let us discuss important uh, issues for the exam and also newspaper. If you see the last previous question papers, there are three areas where you can get a question. One is fly ash, second is cold bed methane, third is graphene. Fly ash, cold bed methane, third is graphene. You have to read in detail about these three issues. GRA, PHNE, graphene, fly ash and cold bed methane. Repeatedly questions were asked in these areas. Recently, Government of India launched Ash Track Mobile App. Ash Track Mobile App for fly ash management. Recently, Government of India launched Ash Track Mobile App for fly ash management. It is a web based management system. It's a fly ash mobile application named Ash Track, launched by Ministry of Power. Ash Track, the fly ash mobile app, is launched by Ministry of Power. It will enable better management of fly ash. It will enable better management of fly ash. Produced by thermal plants. Produced by thermal plants. By providing an interface between ash producers like thermal power plants and potential users, cement plants. Thermal power plants produce fly ash and cement plants use, they use fly ash. The app shows coal based power plants within a radius of 100 kilometers to 300 kilometers from a given location. From 100 kilometers to 300 kilometers from a given location. This app will give plant wise, utility wise, and state wise fly ash utilization status. Plant wise, utility wise, and state wise fly ash utilization status. This app will help in effectively monitoring and reviewing. This app will help in effectively monitoring and reviewing for increasing fly ash utilization. Fly ash is used in manufacturing of cement, bricks, tiles, etc. Fly ash is used for manufacturing of cement, bricks, tiles, etc. Okay, this fly ash app will help in protecting the environment because we know where it is being used, how it is being used. Fly ash is very very dangerous to environment. So effective recycling and effective utilization of fly ash will help in reducing the environmental pollution. So fly ash is a very important area for prelims exam. Already questions are asked and questions are expected from this area. And fly ash track, ash track is a mobile app to show how fly ash is being used if it was launched by Ministry of Power. As I told you, graphene, fly ash and coal bed methane. These are the three areas where you can get regularly questions. These three areas you have to prepare. Graphene and uh, coal bed methane, we will discuss fly ash also. We will discuss in some other class. Next, Janandriya festival, J-A-N-A-N-A-D-R. J A N D R I Y A H. Janandriya festival. Saudi is celebrating annual Janandriya festival. Saudi Arabia is celebrating annual Janandriya festival. India in this year is given guest of honor for this festival. India this year is given guest of honor for this festival. Our foreign affairs minister, external affairs minister, Sushma Swaraj inaugurated it along with King Abdullah Aziz. Janandriya festival, Sushma Swaraj inaugurated along with King Abdullah Aziz. It is an animal national heritage and cultural festival. So animal national heritage and cultural festival. You know their uh, regular thing is camel, camel heart races, horse races uh, and falcon races etc are organized. 
as part of festival. Camel, horse and other races are being organized as a part of festival. Next. Tawang. Tawang is in Arunachal Pradesh. Very famous for Tawang Valley. Tawang gets Rhododendron Fest Park. Rhododendron Park. R-H-O-D-O-D-E-N-D-R-O-N. Rhododendron Park. R-H-O-D-O-D-E-N-D-R-O-N. Tawang gets Rhododendron Park. In an effort to conserve the dwindling Rhododendron species, in an effort to conserve the dwindling rhododendron species of Tawang, a rhododendron park has been established in Tawang Valley, Arunachal Pradesh. A rhododendron park has been established in Tawang Valley, Arunachal Pradesh. Rhododendrons are found from subtropical forests to alpine shrubs. Subtropical forests to alpine shrubs. Rhododendron Park is being established at Tawa Valley. Go Ministry of Women and Child Development is contemplating to establish National Women Entrepreneurship Council. Ministry of Women and Child Development is contemplating to establish National Women Entrepreneurship Council to encourage business entrepreneurship in women. The Ministry of Women and Child Development is anticipating to establish National Women Entrepreneurship Council. 21st Indian Bird Birding Fair. 21st Indian Birding Fair. It is in Rajasthan, Mansagar Lake. 21st Indian Birding Fair is being conducted in Rajasthan at Mansagar Lake. M A N S A G R Mansagar Lake. As you all know, Prime Minister Narendra Modi visited Ramallah. The working capital of uh, Palestine, India and Palestine have inked six agreements in different areas. India and Palestine have inked six agreements in different areas. Super Specialty Hospital in Bethlehem. Super Specialty Hospital in Bethlehem. And uh, constructing India Palestine Center for Empowerment of Women. India Palestina Center for Empowerment of Women. Setting up of National Printing Press at Ramallah. Setting up of, setting up of National Printing Press at Ramallah. Constructing schools, constructing various schools and constructing schools especially even for one school for boys. All these things, there are many agreements, six agreements made between India and Palestina in Ramallah. There was an aeroplane crash, Russia Saratov Airlines crash, 71 people died in Moscow. Saratov Airlines, S-A-R-A-T-O-V, Saratov Airlines. Prime Minister Narendra Modi spoke at length about cyber security and cyber sports, cyber terrorism in UAE. Narendra Modi discussed at length about cyber security related issues in the United Arab Emirates. You know this. And uh, Mori also inaugurated, uh, launched, Mori also inaugurated the temple work in Abu Dhabi. The temple, uh, Hindu temple is being constructed. That was initiated by our Prime Minister <coughs> Narendra Modi. As you all know, our Prime Minister is in three, uh, three country visit. Yemen, UAE and Jordan. Yemen, UAE and Jordan. Three countries he is in visit. It's a good thing that Prime Minister of India also actually pursuing look west policy, not only look west policy. Prime Minister is also actually pursuing look west policy and we are going towards Middle East also. Very good move for India. And uh, in Assam, five elephants died with the train accident. Five elephants died with train accident. Unfortunate thing is man-animal conflict is a very have become a regular phenomenon in India. Most of the elephants are territorial. Elephants are territorial. Tigers are territorial because they need large tracts of land for their survival, for their food, for their water. They travel for eight kilometers, nine kilometers, ten kilometers. 
and mankind is entering into their domain. Instead of thinking that animals are coming into human life, humans are going into their own territories. That is the reason why man animal conflict. You are seeing regular tiger coming out, tranquilization. And you also know Telangana Hartek Hartha Haram program launched by KCR. When he launched it, he told Vanalo Vapas Ravali, Kotal Vapas Pawali. Why monkeys are coming to urban conglomerations? Because monkeys don't have now their habitat. Their separate habitat they don't have. So monkeys, peacocks, uh, wolves, tigers, and then uh, elephants. Man animal conflict have become a very big issue. Rail accidents, animal death, all those things. This year means in GS3, you may expect question man animal conflict. A 10th marker or 15 marker, man animal conflict issue, you have to explain. The recent tigers coming out and killing humans, man eater tigers, or elephants getting meeting with the train accidents, humans entering into their area, as you all know, core areas, buffer zones. Four areas humans cannot enter, buffer zones, with national parks, bio, biosphere reserves, all those things, you have to discuss at length on these issues. Next article is on states of health. States of health. Recently, in the union budget, national health protection program, protection scheme was launched to cover 10 crore people with 5 lakhs insurance. And uh, Niti Aayog released health report, health index in the states. Healthcare index. Niti Aayog's first index, health index. Kerala, Punjab and Tamil Nadu are the best performing states. Kerala, Punjab and Tamil Nadu are the best performing states. UP, Rajasthan, Bihar, Orissa, Madhya Pradesh. They are not performing yet. UP, Rajasthan, Bihar, Orissa, Madhya Pradesh. They are not showing good indices in the healthcare. Here healthcare means, you, if you see neonatal deaths in uh, Orissa, Uttar Pradesh and other states, it looks very, very pathetic. And healthcare means nutrition, AIDS, immunization levels, TB levels, institutional deliveries, all these things are taken as a criteria. Institutional deliveries, nutrition levels and other things are taken as a criteria. Okay, this is states of health. Next article, let the chips fall where they may. Let the chips fall where they may. This article is written by Happy Man Jokov. This is relating to India and Maldives. India and Maldives relation. What is there inside the article? Nothing. The other told India should not intervene in Maldives internal affairs. India should not intervene in Maldives internal affairs. That was the gist of the article. They have, he has given many reasons. One, India's traditional law intervention policy and uh, that small neighbors might look that India is showing a big brotherly attitude. As you all know, Nepal issue, Sri Lankan issue, Sri Lankan Tamil issue, Nepal Madeshi issue, now Maldives, the internal crisis in Maldives. India, it is best to not to follow active intervention in the Maldives issue. But uh, as a regional power, India should show, that is my opinion. This is Happy Man Jacob's opinion. Next article, and you all know, in 1971, in Bangladesh liberation, when India involved, India has to face a refugee crisis, also forced immigration also into the India. Next important article is about turf war. The Bombay Stock Exchange, the National Stock Exchange, and Metropolis Stock Exchange of India, now they are, going, they are not going to share their data with foreign stock exchanges who are trading in derivatives. They are not going to share their data with foreign stock exchange who are doing with derivatives except that which is related to exchange traded funds because they want to protect their interest with foreign companies should not yield much profits out of Indian support. This is the gist. Next article is about hardly a game changer. National Health Protection Scheme National Health Protection Scheme, which is able to make a very big difference in human beings' life. Now we cannot say it is going to help because there are many issues here. Whether health insurance to how many people? 10 crore poor households, poor families, up to 5 lakhs investment. This is the first thing. And the second thing, the target group. 
how to target? Is it only BPL families or upper? What is out of pocket expenditure? Is it insurance model or in infrastructure? It is going to be insurance model. Whether insurance model will work or not. Okay, all these things were discussed in that case. And uh, Bangladesh National Party, Khalida Zia, got rigorous imprisonment for five years on corruption charges. Khalida Zia got rigorous imprisonment for five years on corruption charges. One thing you have to remember, when Awami League comes to India, it is good for India. Awami Links comes to in Bangladesh, it is good for India because Sheikh Hasina is favourable to India. Khalida Zia is not that favourable. To that extent we are good. But the stability in Bangladesh is also equally important. The stability in Bangladesh is also equally important because it is our neighbouring country and we share the largest border with, longest border with Bangladesh. Next article, Renika Chaudhary's laugher in the Rajya Sabha and Modi compared with some other story in Ramayana. So that article, a woman have the right to happiness, right to laugh, right to smile, right to enjoy her own life. That was a heading. <coughs> this is India. We can do anything. And uh, India and UAE, India and UAE to deepen their strategic ties and counter terrorism. India and UAE to deepen their strategic ties and counter terrorism. So these are the important current affairs today.